Politics is not allowed in the Olympics and Black Lives Matter is a political organisation. That's what someone tweeted today as users took to the social media platform to voice their thoughts on the International Olympics Committee's recent announcement. The IOC announced that athletes competing in the Games will not be allowed to express political statements or wear Black Lives Matter merchandise. The postponed Olympics aren't too far away, taking place in July now in Tokyo. But with no international fans in attendance, that's not the only thing that will be different this time. The IOC have already had a long-standing ban on demonstrational or political, religious or racial propaganda after many athletes over the years either raised a fist in the air or kneeled during the national anthem. The Rule 50 ban, which is the formal name for forbidding these political, religious or racial demonstrations, had been under discussion by the IOC, but last month it was decided it would remain in place. The committee announced in April they interviewed around 3,500 athletes from 185 different Olympic committees, and around 70% said it was not appropriate to express these kind of views at the Games. But now the rule will also include banning Black Lives Matter apparel, However, words like peace, respect, solidarity, inclusion and equality are allowed on clothing. This only really includes on the medal stand, playing field or during the official ceremonies, but during press conferences or meetings, it's fine to wear. An IOC spokesperson said, A very clear majority of athletes said that they think it's not appropriate to demonstrate or express their views on the field of play, at the official ceremonies or at the podium. So our recommendation is to preserve the podium, field of play and official ceremonies from any kind of protest or demonstrations or acts perceived as such. Twitter users took to the platform to share what they thought about the announcement. One person wrote, I'm a BLM supporter, but imagine if everyone went to the Olympics to do politics. Imagine every country airing their political problems. It would stop being about sports. That's what the United Nations is for. Another said, Athletes should just boycott. This is violation of free speech. They are not employees of the Olympics. There is no word on if athletes would be punished or what that would involve if they did break the rules.